Hello, everybody, and welcome to Space Quest. Space Quest number one. We're going to skip the intro, because I don't want to be bothered with the intro. I started to play this game a little while ago. Um, didn't get very far. couldn't remember exactly what I was doing. Then I upgraded my computer. Lots of issues with the actual ability to play Space Quest in Windows 8, but I've installed some patches, things like that, got to a point where I can play again, uh, and record as well. And that robot's going crazy! So much faster research droid blows by and it is. Perhaps you could provide some relaxation therapy instruction to reduce his level of tension. Sure, why not? I'm startled by the sound of an alarm, breaking through it, the intercom crackles with the frightened voice of a technician shouting that the Arcada has been boarded by unknown intruders. The transmission ends abruptly in a snowstorm, a soundstorm of white noise, soon overtaken by the cold din of silence. I hear the overly cheerful voice of the ship's computer saying destruction sequence is engaged. 15 minutes till detonation. So I have, I remember, <laughs> I've played this game before. It's been many, many, many years since I've gotten anywhere with it. Uh, I think you can control yourself. You can control yourself with arrow keys as well, but we're just going to click around. Um, I know that there's enemies going to be coming after me, and I need to somehow avoid them. Uh, this is a wall, but I can go down. Uh, I'm going to miss a lot. Let me look through. Another hallway aboard the arcade. There's an elevator door nearby. Okay, so let's go this way. <laughs> this game is so ancient. Love it. Oh, lots of dead people. What do you got? What do you got? I hear footsteps. Um, let's... Curious to know as a daylight detection is dead. Normally you wouldn't be able to tell, except that his intestines are hanging out of the scorched opening where his abdominal wall used to be. Good way to tell. Uh, you remember that he was forced to serve in the Xena National Guard, but that was bitter. So I hear footsteps, so I need to escape. I think I escaped. Whoa. Donna! Yet another crewman, motionless body, reduces the shine of the floor wax. Hugh doesn't look too neat and clean with his lungs hanging out like that. Does he have anything? Search the body reveals nothing. Okay, let's go search this guy. Oh god, it's like all Star Trek-y sounding. Oh, search the body reveals nothing. Great, what's this? Um, I said what was that? Not just take it and do nothing with it. What is this? I have three, oh, three buckazoids. A genuine widget. You're not sure what it does, but it's heavy. It looks cool, and it might be magnetic. Please keep this away from the game discs. So, okay, so it's magnetic. This looks like a teleporting pad based on the Star Generator research pedestal. It has apparently been trashed. This thing looks like it came out the front of, a, of an old Studebaker. Or maybe the Batmobile. Anyway, it appears non-functional at this time. It was probably damaged in the heist. I can't do anything with it anyway. Uh, can't grab stuff. Is this something on the ground or is that nothing? Nope, that's nothing. So, let me quickly save just to... Uh, Beginning with Magnet. So I saved. I think I saved. Yeah, I saved. So I can escape from here. Remember, I'm on a timer. But I gotta watch out with these guys with the footsteps. The footsteps are really gonna throw me off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Crazy robot. Can I grab... Search you real quick? Oh, God. Search reveals nothing to carry so quickly can I just run back here again I don't want to just keep going in and out the same door that was a problem with some of these old Sierra games is you quickly had to go back and forth it was random on if you I had nothing I'd even care God, footsteps again get out Okay, I've already searched this room though. So there's nothing on those two guys. So can I just go this way really quickly? I heard footsteps, but I escaped before the footsteps got to me. You seem to be on the wrong level to do that. Oh, <laughs> I'm underneath. Okay. Is this just a cut through? I missed everything to the left. I need to get to the left. 
but those stupid footsteps I keep hearing. So I guess we'll search to the right. If I hear footsteps again, I'm so going to be dead. This is Stuart, one of your crewmates. He appears now unfunctional. He used to get with him about when he was alive. <laughs> My god. I'm not going to be able to do anything in here. Let me just escape really quickly again. Run back in, search him, and then run to that elevator. Oh my god! Searched his freaking body! Other than the carbonized matter, search reveals nothing. Oh, please, 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 please. Okay, let's just get in here. I know you're probably going to tell me I hear footsteps again. Can, can I speed up the game speed? Will it increase all speed or just me walking? <laughs> Those guys will never notice me here. That was weird. Uh, a pair of viewing port protrudes from the materials. Okay, let's... Well, why can't I look at the viewing port? Seems like it's something I'd want to view. The monitor gives a readout about the ship's status. Only lab scientist really knows or knows exactly what is monitored. So apparently nothing is going to happen over here, which is good. What is this? One of the screens is some green dude you've never seen the likes of. He seems to be talking about but the audio. The audio is out in this area of the ship. It's turned on. As well as it will come in. Let's face it, the guy's going to be ugly no matter how I adjust it. Oh my god! I want to look at this thing real quick. The architects must have been low on oxygen when they came up with this. Okay, so there's nothing here. Get out. This is ridiculous. I need to... I don't know exactly what I need to do, actually, is the problem. I'm sure I'm going to hear footsteps again. Of course I do. It's a viewport, so I can escape into that corner of the room. Oh, this just took me like in a big circle. That's that guy from the beginning. So let's just... So I couldn't do anything over there. I need to get up into this room. Yeah, I hear the footsteps, I know. Can I make it out in time? Footsteps are a bit annoying. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm on the lower echelon of this, so I need to get into the top. So I'm going to hear these footsteps again, right? Yep. So let's just get in here. I hope the footsteps were coming from... Okay, down below. Thank God. This is the Model DX Cartridge Retrieval Unit. Its function is to retrieve and return cartridges from and to the storage unit. It's currently empty. Uh, let's make you give me something. Uh, Ten minutes till detonation. I hear ya, lady. Okay. Buttons allow you to enter a code into the computer. Now the, the problem is... Bloop, 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 bloop. Enter! Apparently, Ken took that one home. That means he'll never get it back, so don't bother checking back later. So I need to find out what code I need. And the question is, is the code that I need gonna be... Control panel of a data retrieval, data retrieval console. Is it in the manual, which was an old form of copy protection, or is it actually on the ship? Okay, exit. I gotta I gotta hurry. Uh so I need him to retrieve me something. I just don't know what yet. Uh what's in here? Just a closet? It's good that I hear the footsteps. Okay, so I think this is just me hiding in a closet. Just stumbled into a small, dark, and very cluttered utility closet. Many things fall, and most of them land on you. It doesn't say much for your cleaning prowess. So let's let these guys come on through. Failing to notice anyone in anything in the room, Sarian guards decided to check elsewhere. So I hid. I don't know if I'm now allowed to stay in this room as long as I want. Six minutes! Okay, now I'm just gonna be down there again. Did I make it down here before? 
I did. Can we go up? I don't know which way you're coming from, footsteps. Get out of the room. Who is this? All reminds of Jerry. Oh, sorry. Uh, one of the few techno dudes aboard who sometimes tolerated your company. Your low clearance excludes you from visiting him during the performance of his duties in the elegant lower level of the airlock. I find a key card. Okay. Key card. Key card fits into an electric lock someplace in the Arcadia. Doesn't say anything though. So it doesn't have my code on it. So there's no way I'm going to have time to be able to do what I need to do. I'm going to hear footsteps, right? Yes, I do. Uh, can I use it? There was no like place to use this in here, wasn't there? The door opens. The man he recognizes one of the head lab scientists stumbles into the room. He appears to be in a serious need of some abdo seal abdomen filler. Oh, good God. The timer's still going. He hits the floor with a thud. Can I talk to him, or is he dead? Come on, come on, hurry up. Hurry, talk to the man. His lips move. The star generator is in danger. The arcade is under attack. You better get off this this scow if you value your life, Wilco. Just before your system sees all functions shortly of decay, he looks over toward the shelves full of cartridges and utters astral bodies. With one last gasp, he his lifeless form slumps to the floor. Okay, astral bodies. Let me go look at the manual. I bet astral bodies is something to do with the code in the manual and there's a way to look at the manual uh with this collection through steam so hold on one second though i'm going to save it again just not in the same spot because i'm just going to type astral bodies because i'm not going to make it okay so i need to what's the pause button I don't know. Okay, so I was correct in my assertion that it was going to be in the book. So I'm looking at what Astral Bodies is. Astral Bodies is... Oh my god, I gotta... Hold on, move this over. Two little dashes on the side. I can't really see this that well. Two dashes on the side. I think it's, it's this one? One line, that one, an Five H looking thing, definition. and a double dash on this. Oh, it's the same as the first one. That, oh, that's not the same as the first one. Crap. I think that's wrong. Can't take that one home. Excellent. Double dash U, this one. H double dash U. Can take that one home. He said astral bodies, right? Thirty seconds till destination. Thirty seconds. What? It's not this one. Fifteen. We had five. We had five minutes left. Wait. Something must be wrong with the time on this. Let me. Let me see if I can zip through. <laughs> that didn't make any sense at all. Um. I know you see my little fraps recording thing in the corner of this. Let me, let me look at this again. 537, yeah. So, I, why is it going so fast? Anyways, Astral Bodies is definitely the code sequence here is this guy. This guy. Maybe I had the wrong one. I was not playing in full screen. Cartridge found! Okay, so I must have been typing in the wrong code. Good, now we got five minutes left. Exit. Oh, no, 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 no. Five 
Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh. I missed. I hit the wrong button. Okay, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. Enter. Cartridge found. I had to get the cartridge from him. Hopefully this is all I have to do on this thing. Gimme. Thank you. So. Save. Quickly. Save. Astral bodies. Cartridge. Get. Okay. So now what do I do with it? It's a cartridge from the Arcadis data archive. I didn't see where this thing went though. I really need to hurry. If I turn the game speed down, does it not change the clock at all? Okay, hold on. Doesn't change the clock at all. So let's just go up to full speed. Let's get in this closet again really quick. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Okay, they... Even though I'm chasing them, they don't notice me. Four minutes to get out of here. Four minutes. I heard you. No definition. Not no 15 seconds like you gave me last time for some odd reason. I'm just running all the way. I don't care. Oh wait, what was in there? I forget what was in here. Oh no no. Uh, let me make sure that none of these have to go over here. I think they all go upstairs. Nope, okay, okay. Okay, sorry sorry I'm wasting your time. Sorry about that. Wasting time, wasting time. Hopefully at least this will stop the detonation sequence and I can stop running around like a crazy man. Because I really feel completely out of control in a ship that's about to explode. Let's go in here. That's fine. But I'm going down, right? Yeah. What are these? A pair of viewing ports. I can't do anything with them. Um... That doesn't go in them. That doesn't go in them. Nope, nope, nope. Look quick. My nose read out about the ship status. Only left scientists really know what it does. Who knows what that is? A designer conduit system runs through here. It carries the ventilation ducting as well as different types of wiring. Uh, magnet. Three. Can't yeah. magnet the wires. Okay, whatever, whatever. Kill so that's nothing. So I need to get in here. But I don't know what I'm supposed to do in here. Place looks a monument. Oh my god. Okay, let's just go this way real quick. Can I go over here? I, I know I heard the footsteps. Barely snuck out of there. Okay, what do we got here? What do we got here? Uh, bay doors. Open. Don't know why I did that. Remote monitoring panel for some of the ship's systems. Attempts to understand the purpose always made your brain hurt, but you know that glowing red isn't good, especially since some stuff is connected to the reactor's cooling system. If I go in here, am I gonna die? I might. I got the key card. Key card. Slide the key card in the slot, lock releases and satisfying click, and the elevator locks slide open. What's in here? Control panel has many confusing gauges on it. The one you can read says caution, launch bay decompressed. There are no controls in the panels, populate all the gauges and readouts. Two minutes. I hear you. Airlock. Kill definition. There's a button above the rectangular object below. Oh god. Save. Uh keycard get two. I hit the button. You know some sort of gadget in the drawer. I took it. What is it? Some sort of gadget. You're not sure what it does, but it has a switch. Well, let's hit the switch then. Switch on the gadget. 
There's a closet that looks familiar, but you can't quite place it. Spacesuit. Get the spacesuit. Spacesuit. Okay, let's go in here. Let's get out of this place. Uh, some alien anchor being is broadcasting a message about the stolen generator. Can I just get in here and leave? <laughs> Are you serious? Come on. Gadget in the drawer. I'm switching it on. I don't know if that's good or bad. Putting on my spacesuit. Get it. And let's get out here slowly. Make my way to this platform. We're going to save again just because that was dumb. Oh, as in old school Sierra games. Okay, get in. Inside the arcade is speed pod, or escape pod is not exactly packed with luxurious appointments. However, when it comes to saving what's posterior, the pod is as good as... Okay, so let's go. Nothing happens without power. Uh, doesn't this magnetic thing do power? How do I... Come on. What about this? One minute. I don't even know where it would go. Kill detonation. How do I not turn it on? So how do I give it power? I don't need that right now. But yes, I do. I do, though. Can I get out? I got less than a minute to find out how to power this thing. There's no buttons on there, though, it said, right? No controls in the panel. It's popular by gauges and readouts. So I can't... I can't do anything. 30 seconds. Kill detonation. There's nothing that's telling me what to do! A giant silver pill-shaped pot sits in the fire. This is a vehicle bay. Sorry, I'm not reading it. I'm just trying to get in. Wait, what? I think it exploded, even though there was 15 seconds left. Yep. Huh. Give me a minute to try to figure out what I missed. It was pretty messy. Judgment call. Uh, <sighs> okay, we are restoring, what was this one? Okay, so this is when I still have two minutes. Okay, so I had to read a little walkthrough. Apparently I didn't miss anything. I just read it up to this point, but apparently I have to buckle my seatbelts and then hit a power button? That's somewhere? Okay, where's the power then? Okay. So that's apparently power. One minute. The option only works. Kill Clear the Arcadia. You'll need to leave launch bay first. Okay, fine, leave. I slide the rail forward, you can feel the Arcadia start to move. Okay. Yes! <laughs> that was much more brutal than it needed to be. So I have cleared the Arcadia. Stay tuned to find out what happens to Roger Wilco in Space Quest 1. Next.